Hey guys, welcome to another video. Okla speed test is one of the most used applications in the entire world to measure the speed of your internet connection. And in this video, we are going to review this application from start to scratch. We're going to take a look at all the available options that are there on this application, how the application works, how it measures the speed. So we're going to talk about all of that. Please stay with us as it's going to be a very interesting video. You can find it on iOS store or Android uh, Google Play store and you can simply go ahead and search for it and install it the way you search for it. You can just simply go to the iOS store or Android Apple store to search for speed test. You can write speed test and you should see it speed test. So the first results that you see is going to be speed test by Okla. You can open up the application now this is an application that is used to check your internet speed so we're going to start off with the speed test itself as soon as you open up the application you're going to see this interface and it's telling you to click go and once you hit go it's actually going to connect and give you your speed test so it's going to actually first of all give you what's your downloading speed uh, on the top of your screen you guys can see the ping jitter and loss percentage so right now our uploading speed is being measured and our downloading speed has already been measured and it's showing up on the top left corner 27.9 mbps that's our downloading speed and right now we're measuring the uploading speed which is 39.4 with that you guys can see that we have the speed test results there and these are widely accepted uh, speed test results so you know this is one of the most reliable applications that is used worldwide now the next option is we also have an option to check video performance so if you're streaming videos let's say on youtube so you can also check and measure and give you the results that if you play videos how's the quality going to look like like uh, if you can stream 4k videos 1080p videos so right now it's actually measuring our video quality and the speed that we have what type of videos can be played so right now i think it has measured it's still in the process so right now it's testing 1080p previously it tested uh, 720p and right now it's testing 40 uh, 1440p so we're not at 4k yet i think now it's testing 4k and we'll see if 4k works which is very unlikely so maximum resolution that we can get with this current speed is 1440p so this is very useful as well it also to told us that uh, the load time is 10 14 milliseconds and buffering is zero percent as you guys can see on the top right of the screen 1440p is qhd resolution which is pretty good but still not 4k so we cannot get 4k on the device yet we can also see that it tells us that maximum resolution of 1440p qhd is good for video on large phones large tablets large laptops and large tvs okay the third option that we have on the application is to turn on a vpn so it gives us a vpn it says as it says it's free secure fast vpn enable protection now so you can use this uh, this option as well on the top right corner you have the hamburger icon if you click on it it can tell you the results that we have measured in the past so a list of all the results that are there all the video results that are there uh, that you measure in the past so you can get all of those here it always saves those unless you reset the application second option is settings and you guys can see it has the option to remove ads but there's extra payment involved and it's asking for some money i'm not going to pay that uh, you can also restore purchases it has an option of analytics so you can actually allow speed test to collect advanced analytics and crash reports if you want to select it you can select it otherwise you can uncheck this option and then the last option is themes so you can have pure black or you can have the default theme right now i have it at default but you can select pure black if you like about about privacy and terms so you can get some terms and conditions and about this application and then support so if you're having issues you can just get speed test help you can click on it it's going to give you some articles uh, for your help from the help center you guys can actually go through these articles and it's going to give you answers to your questions now this is a very minimalistic app but it has a lot of data in it and it is as i said 
used worldwide right now it's giving me the information about my network so it's a zong telecom iphone 11 pro max that's my device that i'm using the location units i've selected mbps and scale 100 connection type it's multi or single that's about it or okla speed test application guys if you have any questions let me know in the comments section and i'll try to answer as many as i can thanks for watching have a good one Bye.